Madam Speaker, Canada's economy needs improved productivity, and for that we need to grow our workforce, more highly skilled immigrants, more people with the skills and the training and knowledge that employers require. But here's the problem, Madam Speaker. People can't afford to live in some of our economic generating cities because of out-of-control housing inflation. When will this government take concrete steps to curb inflation, increase the housing supply, and get Canada back into a leadership position in the G7? The Honourable Parliamentary Secretary. Got enthusiasm for immigration as a strategy to grow the economy, and I look forward to tabling my plan with the immigration levels for the next few years in Canada sometime next week. He's right. We need to manage immigration in an appropriate way so the workers who do come here to fill gaps in the labor force to maximize our economic potential do have a place to live. Madam Speaker, with record labor shortages, despite the fact that we have more jobs in Canada now than before the pandemic, immigration is going to be an important part of Canada's growth strategy, and I look forward to working with our Minister of Housing to ensure the national housing strategy makes housing more affordable for Canadians, including those who come to Canada. The Honourable Member for Nanaimo.